Well, Pear, thank you for joining us. Lovely to meet you. Uh, our Sadler supporter from Sweden. Um, we're speaking just after the Stockport FA Cup. So, you know, what a game that was. Did you watch it and uh, what did you make of it? Yeah, I watched it. It was on, uh, on Swedish television on the, on the streaming service. So I had a chance to see it. And uh, I couldn't barely see the last 10 minutes. <laughs> I ran from the computer and back. But we got we got it in the end. Yeah, it was a very dramatic tie. Um, another late goal was, you know, was a wild celebrations when uh, yeah. that went in. Yeah, I was jumping around. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it was absolutely. Ecstatic. I bet, yeah, as 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 was I, as we, we all were, really. So, um, obviously, you're obviously a big Saddlers fan. I think a lot of our supporters know you from Twitter and, um, you know, you've really made yourself known to Warsaw fans. So, given that you're from Sweden, firstly, how did you first start supporting the Saddlers? How did it come about? Um, <clears throat> the first contact I had with Warsaw was... Um... We have a computer game called Championship Manager. Um, I picked a random team. It, it, the game picked Walsall. So I started managing them and found great success. Then I, after my military service, I was um, unemployed. So I went to a web development course and they told us to pick a subject to create a web page about. So I picked to create a web page about Walsall. Um, back then it was the 97, maybe. The uh, internet wasn't, <laughs> there was not much information about Walsall on, on the internet. So I gathered the information I found and created a web page. And then I put it online. And then I got in contact with many locals, um, Saddlers fans uh, forum and the interest grew and I start following them more and more. And that's it, so obviously, the, sorry, carry on. It's the, it's, so now it's the, my, my only team that I follow. So previously did you have a, a Swedish team that you supported but now it's only Warsaw? Yeah, I, I keep, uh, it was Yves Kujetobori, uh, Gothenburg. Um, I follow them, their results and so, but I don't watch much games. So, it's also too, mostly. So, obviously, you sort of created a web page, you played Warsaw and Championship Manager, and that sort of made you know more about Warsaw. And I guess, was it a case of the more games you managed to watch, you know, the more you fell in love with the team. Yeah, exactly. I, I came in in the right time as well. In the 96, 97, I think it was right when uh, John Sørensen and, and then the year after Graydon came came in. and So it was a few years of only good results and happy times. <laughs> so it, it was a good time to to find find the club, yeah, <laughs> and um, yeah, yep. So yeah, and um, great memories. yep, yep. So, yeah, great memories under uh, Craig Graydon, wasn't it? Yeah, he was. Uh, he was. He's a legend. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So obviously, with your support in Sweden, are there any other Swedish fans that you've got into Warsaw? No. Yeah, I'm, I'm the only one. <laughs> <laughs> I heard of, from someone in Norway for maybe 15, 18 years ago, but I'm, I'm not sure. I'm the only one in Sweden. And obviously, as time's gone on, you know, the clubs have now got the iFollow service. So when that was launched, how great was that for you? You know, because did that make it easier for you to actually follow the team? Yeah, uh, I listened to the games before before I follow came and when there was audio, audio commentary and when we when I got the chance to see see the live video as well it was 
that was a really, really good time to finally watch watch the games and not just listen to the commentary. Yeah, do you enjoy watching the games? And I followed you. Make sure you try not to miss any because obviously being an international supporter, you can can watch pretty much every game, can't you? Yeah, I I try to watch every every game. I think I have missed a few this season because I've been away, but also I have been. I'm writing news about also on a Swedish website about football, so it's it's much easier to have an opinion of on the game if you have seen it. So I try I try to see every match I can. Is it getting a lot of views? Your website about Warsaw? Uh, that website is closed down for a long time. Um, I didn't find any purpose to have it when the information was getting broader and broader in the on the internet. So my website was op- obsolete quite. So it's been closed down for. I have a blog, but I haven't updated it for since in summer. So it's been a busy, busy few months for me, so I haven't had time to do anything. That's fair enough. And obviously, you watched a lot of Warsaw games on I Followed, but last season, I believe, you know, you finally managed to come over to the best Scott. You know, how great was that for you, firstly, just to actually come to the stadium and see the team live? What what was that like for you? It was, it was great. Uh, I was welcomed by everyone. Everyone was very kind. The, the club was, was very kind to me, giving me a match ticket and a shirt. And it was an experience I, I still remember. So, And I look forward to go back. I don't know when it will be, if it will be later this season or next season, maybe. Yeah, great to hear. So it was plans, a great you plan day. to come back. Yeah. If you have been there once, you want to come back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, obviously, you'll have watched a lot of the team this season. What what have you made of the team so far this season? Um, I think we've been doing good, especially the, the last few months. We had a period when, when it didn't go as we hoped. But I believe that we could turn it around, and, and, and we have. So, it's great to... See that the if you have patience and believe in, in uh, you know it will turn around and be successful. So and now I just hope we can push for the playoffs or even automatics if we if we're happy, lucky. Um, that should be the aim anyway. It's not it's not too many points to to away from the third place. So. Hopefully. Absolutely. I'm sure the team, you know, will be aiming for that as well. So obviously which which sort of players uh stand out to you? Who are your favourite players? Um I like players who do the hard work. They might not be seen by everyone, but you you know the the so like Liam Kinsella, you know. You know what you can get from him. It's never a bad, bad game. Uh, Danny Johnson, of course. Many Mont. And yeah, many more. <laughs> the whole team has been done very good. So I just looked through the team from Sunday and everyone in the, in the starting lineup had have scored a goal. I don't know if it uh, has happened before that Every play in the starting eleven has, has a goal in the season. So uh, I think it's more about the team than in individuals. But we, think... we need those uh, individuals to to have the edge and the, like Danny Johnson who can get one chance and one goal. Yeah, the, the team are all contributing this season. You know, it's great to see that. That stat yeah. you point out there, it's a really good stat, isn't it? That the whole team have you know, all chipped in with a goal. Some unexpected goal scorers this season as well. So, um, you know, is every, you know, I'm sure you're like most fans, you're 
optimistic and, you know, I bet you're just excited to watch every game now with the team doing so well. Yeah, I want to watch every game. So that's, I have the weekends free from now until the end of the season, hopefully, so I can watch every game. That's it. You said earlier that, you know, you're, you're the only Warsaw fan in Sweden. Would you hope to find more or persuade some more people to watch Warsaw as well? Yeah, it would be very, very fun to have someone to, especially to to go over to watch live. And now I'm traveling alone. It's it's okay, but it's fun when you have, much more fun when you have a few a few mates with you. Absolutely. Well, I'm sure even if you know you were to return, there's plenty of Warsaw fans who would. You know, happily share a drink with you in the stadium suite and we'll happily let you sit sit next to them, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. Yeah, that, that's that's what the club's about. You know, it's a, a community. Do you feel that way, even though you're, you're from Sweden, do you feel part of the Warsaw community, you know, because, you know, you're on social media as well. So do you feel feel a part of it? Yeah, I think it's very important to to be a part of the community and help when you, if you can so uh, that's one reason I, I like the club as well it's a very familiar feeling everyone takes care of everything so you don't feel alone and you're included and, and the club is making very much in the community and with all the other organizations as well as mental health organizations and so on so that's uh, very important part of the club. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. You know, there's some fantastic work our partners Kaleidoscope do as well. So it's great to work with them. And, you know, we'd really, really look forward to hopefully seeing you back here at the Paraland Beskett Stadium either this season or next season. Um, I'm sure you'll let us know when you come in and we, it'll be great to welcome you again. Yeah, I will be trying to get back this season, but I, I don't give any promise, but I, I will do what I can to to come over. It's not it's not <laughs> that um, it's quite expensive to to get over. So it's like a season ticket each trip. So it takes have to plan and pick the right match. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Maybe an away game should be would be very fun to to watch as well. That would the Sadler's fans love, you know, always traveling their numbers away from them. They're absolutely fantastic. And, yeah, you know, they're singing the songs. So, you know, I'm sure that'll be a fantastic experience if you one day get to do it. Yeah, I I have hopes to, to do it, but maybe not this season. But it depends on the fixtures next season. If you if you are lucky, I can maybe get the one home and away game in the same trip. Brilliant. Yeah. Well, we, we look forward to that and hopefully you can enjoy the rest of the season watching the Saddlers. Thank you so much um, for speaking to us, Pear, and um, up the Saddlers. Yeah, up the Saddlers.